Hey and welcome to a new episode of our crypto trading crash course. On today's episode we want to talk about leverage and show you how you can use it to amplify your profits. For today, I've opened a US dollar TIFA account, which I've deposited 10,000 US dollar TIFA on. I've even activated a bonus uh, that gives me 700 US dollar TIFA extra for trading. You'll find the promo code for this bonus in the description of this video, so you can profit from this as well. Now, in order to best show you the impacts uh, leverage and margin can have on your position sizing, I want to trade again here Bitcoin versus US dollar. So I'm clicking on the buy button here. Uh, I'm going to leave it uh, at the order type market here for now. I Let's say I want to trade one Bitcoin versus US dollar. And you can see here uh, a number that changes always that is called margin impact. This is basically the amount of money you need to have on your account uh, that is not bound by other trades already that is uh, available that you can open this position. So in order to, to buy one Bitcoin US dollar or sell one Bitcoin US dollar worth at the moment 22,300 US dollar, you just need to have 113 US dollar on your account. And this is because Prime XPT offers you a so-called leverage of 1 to 200. You'll find information about this leverage here on the Prime XPT uh, website as well under about fees and condition. You can see here Bitcoin US dollar leverage of max leverage 1 to 200 or uh, if you're more into uh, calculating it the other way around you just need 0.5 percent of the uh, worth of, of the net worth of your position to open a position. Now if I also want to point punch in my stop loss and take profit already I can I can do so. Let's say I want to be uh, to buy I want to be stopped out at 12,000 um, US dollars and I have a take profit of 35,000 US dollars. You will always see here immediately also my the projected profit or loss uh, in US dollar. So in my case, if the price would go down to 12,000 US dollars, I would lose 10,300 US dollars. So I would have bankrupted my account or here already I would have lost all of my money. Now I could be tempted, of course, to say, wow, you know, this is great. I just need 113 uh, roundabout US dollars to buy one whole Bitcoin as a trading position here. I, well, I don't want to just buy one. Maybe I want to buy 10. You can see the margin impact jumps up, of course, here. So now I have to have 1,700 US dollars roughly in, uh, in equity available, in balance available on my trading account. I have 10,700 available at the moment, so no problem opening this. However, if you look now at the stop loss price and take profit and the projected loss and profit, you will notice something. So should Bitcoin now go down from 22,300 to 12,000 where I want to place my stop loss, I would have a projected loss of 103,000 US dollars. Should Bitcoin go up to 35,000, I would have a projected profit of 126,000 US dollars. And this is due to the fact that I as uh, that of course, when the price moves against me, I have a position of 10 Bitcoin moving against me. So a move of just $1,000 down from 22,300 to 21,300 would immediately also mean a loss of 10,000 US dollars. So actually my position would already be uh, cancelled and stopped out at roughly 21,000 US dollars. So you want to be careful here how you use leverage in this case. Uh, you can go up to 1 to 200 in leverage. However, it's not always the best choice to do so. I highly advise to not exceed for the beginning at least a leverage of 1 to 5 uh, until 1 to 10 maximum uh, because you know we cannot always be right about uh, our trading position especially when it comes also to the with the timing of a trading position. So we want, need to ensure as traders 
that we always have enough funds on the account uh, that we still can trade in next position after our current position should be stopped out with a loss. And if you lose 50% or 80% or even 100% with just one trade, well, it's very hard, of course, to recover from this again. So before you enter your next trade, you might want to play around here a little bit. Uh, I, I can only really recommend here that you click this box, play stop loss, take profit. So you can see really at your chosen top stop loss, at your chosen take profit, what would be your projected loss or your projected profit. And if you then see that your projected loss would be something like 30, 50, 80 or 100 percent of your account or maybe you see in this case here over 100% you might want to lower uh, the position size in my case let's say back to one bitcoin maybe that's it for today if you enjoyed this video why not leave us a like and subscribe to the channel and we are going to see each other again next friday take care and bye bye